was a video the other day. You ain't no operator and pushing no piles. Well, I ain't tried to be an operator. I told y'all in the video where I walked it down there that I ain't no operator. And that bulldozer, I ain't being cocky or anything, but that's just a toy. That thing wasn't bought to grade or nothing. It was bought for the farm. So why, why would you, I'm going to pass this. I'm tired of running 30. Oh, why would you even make that comment, especially when I warn all y'all that I am no dozer operator, but it's not rocket science for what I'm doing. I'm just pushing piles, maybe making a fire lane or something. So I, I just don't, I don't get people. If you don't like what you see, just cut it off. That's what I do. And maybe come back the next day and you might like it. I don't know, people's funny. People's so funny, funny, funny. But I don't appreciate, you know, I love all comments. <clears throat> I do not like the cussing in my comments. There's women watching and men. Man, I mean, most men, they don't want to hear that mess. Golly. You know, I may have a pretty filthy mouth at times when I'm not on camera. But I have made, I have, uh, me and Tim's talked about that too. <clears throat> we try to keep our channels as clean as possible because... You never know who's watching, you know. You know, I mean, I may have a, a kid from school with Cody watching and his mama hear me dropping the F-bomb or something like that. And, well, next time she sees me at the game, she is going to crawl my tail. So it just, it just ain't right. These things are made for entertainment and learning and just, uh, and I am rambling on a little bit going down the road today, but every once in a while we have a video like that. But I like to keep y'all folks that <clears throat> really watch and are dedicated and comment great every day and appreciate. And I do appreciate y'all watching because y'all appreciate what I do and putting the videos out, me and Brian. But, oh, uh, man, just keep the cussing to yourself and the negative comments. If you don't like it, just cut it off. All right, so what I'm doing, I'm getting all fat now. I feel better already. Oh, <clears throat> what I'm going to do, the hog action is, and I have to talk to tell y'all some about the updates and stuff, you know. Oh, the hog action has slowed tremendously. Oh, let's see, we caught them 11, then caught them 3 in the panel trap. I think that was the order they went in. But anyway, <clears throat> had just a little bit of action. I've basically, I've got three traps out and three coverts out. So I basically got six cameras going now. And last night there was, let's see, one, I think three different hogs. Nothing went under the traps and a couple of them was just at the covert. But nothing's being consistent, so I can't move it yet. But I'm going to tell you, we have worked on that butt. I think some people think you can't get rid of them, and I, I really don't think you're going to completely get rid of them. But I'm going to tell you, I have seen a difference. Oh, I may eventually going to move a camera back over there to where we caught so many <coughs> in that one trap. I tell you, it went on about a week and didn't even get a picture of one, so, but I will, I hadn't been back over there lately to check that out, I've been concentrating on other place and got those 11 and 314 out of there, uh, but like I said last night, it was just three different hogs kind of coming through and they're not, they're not being real consistent yet, one spot they're being just a little, little consistent, <clears throat> but it's been two different hogs, it's been a big spotted hog and another smaller bull hog. So I'm not going to move a trap until they get regular, consistent every night. But what I am going down to do, I got two batteries I got to uh, change out in the, both the drop traps and uh, see if we need to freshen the pile up. I'll probably go ahead and check a couple feeders or something when down here. It's going to be a muddy mess, but that's just been the way it's been this year. All right, I'm going to quit rambling. we get down there, we'll be on the ranger doing some work. Alright, Pete's having him a little corn snack. Hand it in. Change the batteries, got two batteries. I check coon traps too.
we had just a little bit of action around this one last night. They just wouldn't come under the trap. They was over there in that old mud hole. All right, y'all. Got us an old possum. Something kind of bad. Old possum. He won't get no more turkey eggs. All right, y'all. <coughs> Hadn't done just a whole lot since I've been back. Food with the feeders a little bit. Cody's in the back of the truck. I've been up here. He's been up here running and I've been timing him. About all I felt fell asleep sitting in the truck a minute ago. Just feeling a little better, but it's gonna take a day or two. But anyway, appreciate y'all watching. Out of here.